Hi, I'm John Hughes and this is my son Duncan and we want to send our milk and dairy products from the Staffordshire Moorlands all the way to the Olympics. We're spreading British wool for the Olympics in 2012. I'm with the Big Brothers. We pasteurise and produce our own milk on site. It's the freshest milk you can get in the whole country. It goes from the cow to bottle to the customer in less than 24 hours. And we'd like the opportunity to give the Olympians of Great Britain and all over the world a chance to have a, a cup of fine English tea made with high quality milk. Taste the best thing for the Olympics. Made in Staffordshire. Pure beef. Burn fruit. Please support. Please at the Olympics, made here in Staffordshire. Made here in Staffordshire. Eat the best of British at the Olympics. I'm Oliver Cartwright from the National Farmers Union. Uh, we're at Hamilton Farm today for Farmhouse Breakfast Week. It's been a brilliant event showcasing local food, great quality Staffordshire produce, and going ahead to the Olympics, we would like to see good regional products well represented. Sorry. And uh, using smartphone technology, it would be great if Staffordshire farms and those producing food in the county send in their videos and uh, really give the county a good plug and show that it's a flagship county for good food. Great British breakfast would be brilliant for the visitors for 2012 Olympics. It's great to be at the Staffordshire breakfast this morning uh, and eating great Staffordshire product, produce. Uh, and I think that this sort of authentic food and giving information about food is something that people really want to know. And of course we have a huge opportunity with the Olympics where people coming to Britain uh, and so this idea of coding much more information, giving people much more information about the authenticity of what they're eating, linking it into the producers, I think is not only a great idea for the Olympics, it's something that we should be for anyway. Hello, I'm Bernard Archer. I farm sheep and suck cattle, beef cattle, and I would love to see the athletes full of British people. Hello, it's a dairy farmers from and we want to provide milk for the Olympics. Hi, my name's Dawn and my name's Jo and we've grown up on farms in Derbyshire. We believe British food is the best and we want to be the winning team at the Olympics in 2012. Hello, we're the Beresford from Stoop Farm. I'm the third generation to farm in the Peak District here. At the moment I'm the Peak Choice Chairman, a cooperative of Peak District farmers who sell beef and lamb direct from off their own farms. All farm to very high welfare and environmental standards. We care for the land to maintain and improve this special area. We can feed the Olympic dream. Hello and welcome to New Close Farm Shop of Bakewell. Uh, these are Bakewell pinwheels, they're uh, quite unique to New Close Farm. Uh, they've been dreamt up by a family member many years ago. It's, uh, we've got pork and apple or lamb and mint. It's uh, wrapped in a puff pastry, so it's 40, 45 minutes on a preheated medium oven. Uh, and they're very nice, very hearty meal. My name's James Armstrong, and I'm a farmer and butcher from Bakewell in Derbyshire. I don't see how the Olympic team can fail if they fed a diet of British meat. Hi, I'm Ricky. I'm 17, and I was made in the Peak District. I live here on this small hill farm, producing high quality food and looking after our amazing landscape. And I'm inviting you to come and visit me, because you'll get a great holiday and I'll get to keep the farm. Without your custom, places like this could just disappear. Anyway, the weather's too good to keep to ourselves. Taste the best of British at the Olympics, reared here in the Peak District. This is smartphone technology. We can use this at the Olympic Games. It's the future of farming. We can get the producer to the consumer. Let's trial this at the Olympic Games.